Ooh, that sounded like coins. Hey everybody, Eric here again from Locker Lunatics. We've got a 10 by 13 today. There's a reason I bought this one. Not a whole lot of stuff in there. There is one reason I bought this, and I'm sure you guys will see it real soon, but without any further ado, let's see what we got. All right, now, they call this a trampoline, which I guess it kind of is. We're just going to scoot this out of the way for a second so we can get the other stuff. Get out some chairs and bounce around. Bounce around. There it is. That is why I bought this unit, guys. We got this unit for $300. And ninety dollars. Let's hope there's something in that safe. Plus, it's about two hours from our house. Now, other than the safe, we could see looks like a really expensive, maybe a wash stand or something like that with a marble top. I see a sewing machine in the back, most likely a singer. We'll see when we get there. Uh, something else that I seen was just some stuff like this. I mean, we got a collectible. That's leather too, leather sleeved. I didn't know it was going to be leather sleeved. So we got a little collectible uh, Corvette racing jacket. Oh, the pink ladies. All right. How cool is that? I bet that's worth a few bucks. I think this one will add up. And some of the collectibles I also seen was in the back. There's boxes of baseball cards. They're newer, probably not worth that much. But what else is in here? Is there stuff in the drawers? We don't know yet. And that looked like a really cheap shelf. Come to find out, it's a really nice bar. So, all right. Let's see what we got here. Do, I, do we move this? Do we move it? Ooh, that sounded like coins. Ooh, and that was my, my suspicions was coins because of the antiques. Moment of truth. It is locked. All right, guys. We probably, we're not going to do this one here. That we're running out of time today. We will be taking this home and we will break this open at the house. There's something in there. Listen. That sounds like coins, don't it? All right. <laughs> Big old heavy safe to start. All right, let's go to a box. Well, before we get to the box, check this out. This is another something I've seen. Look at that. This is, I have one of these. It's not this brand name or nothing, but it says something Frontier on the back. Couldn't tell exactly. What? Freedom, oh, Freedom Town, okay. But this is a really nice embossed leather coat. This coat itself could be, now the one that I have at home, is rare because it's white and I'll be putting it online for probably like 1200 bucks. This one, eh, I'd say probably anywhere from uh, two to $500 on this guy. So there's half the money back right there. All right, let's get a box. Not a lot of boxes in here, let's see what we got. There's pots and pans. Oh boo, and it is pots and pans. Hey. Oh, I'm so under a strain about that safe. All right, let's see what we got, let's get this out of the way. Did you see my shirt? Check this out. Locker Lunatic shirt. My daughter had this made for me for Christmas. Uh, give us a comment. Let me know. Would you guys be interested in these if we had some made? I mean, it's, a, it's YouTube. Gotta have one. Oh, let's see. This looks like I thought it say, uh, maybe a... Uh, no, it's not what I thought it was. I thought a computer. This is some kind of diagnostic monitor. All right. Well, that's kind of cool. That might actually be worth a couple dollars. I'll pick that up. Look her up and see. Not a lot in here. Let's see how long this takes. Okay. This looks like a tool, but it's light. Well, there's a more. Okay, here we go. Gotta be smarter than the plastic. There's a few miscellaneous tools in there. Nothing to write home about. There. Looks like we got extension cords and wires and, and oh my goodness gracious. Look at this, guys. The whole, it looks like the whole bottom of this is Spider Man spray webs. Look down in there. I don't know how much these are selling for, but. Good grief. Looks like they bought this at Goodwill. Let's see. Is that a Goodwill sticker? That is a Goodwill sticker. They're a dollar at Goodwill. There's got to be over a hundred of those in there. So, all right. That's money. That's money. Who doesn't like to make a mess of Spider-Man webs? God, that safe is taunting me. Yeah. We've got... Look, that whole thing's full. That whole thing's just completely full of those. There's probably 200 of those in there. Shoot. If we can put those on eBay at a dollar, two dollars a piece... That's our money back in Spider-Man webs. It's a twisted web we weave. All right, this looks like maybe computer parts and adapters. This looks like maybe a little heater, a little digital, that's a heater, most chance it most goes in. All right, there's a bag. 
Now, this feels like it might actually be garbage. Let's take a look. I do believe that is actual garbage. Well, we have to go through that. Let's make our way over here. This actual garbage? That's a blank, a couple blanks. Nothing more. Now, I've seen the baseball bat when I opened the door. Is it signed? Is it cool? It is a Louisville slugger. It's cracked. So this was probably a game used ball or bat. Uh, we got the model number uh, C243 Pro Stock and it is cracked. So it's probably broken in a game. Wish it was signed. That would make it a lot cooler. And then we've got, I don't have no clue what these are. Some kind of uh, bed. I think it's a bed frame. I think it's like a kid's bed frame. A little plastic, and then you got the big headboard in the back, I would assume. We got lots of totes, uh, lid totes, no totes. And then this, and the pictures, I thought was a really cheap shelf. Looks like it might be a really nice oak bar. The good thing is, it's a really nice oak bar. The bad thing is, because it's not cheap, I'm going to probably have to make another trip to Indianapolis. Alright, so let's check, look, it's got a, it's a copper top. This is nice. Oh my gosh, that's heavy too. That is, that is good for What's the front? Oh, ho, 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 Look at that. Oh my goodness, got the brass footrest. Holy cow. That, guys, is probably more than the cost of the unit. I am happy about that. All right, give us a big thumbs up, guys. Check that out. That is amazing! Oh my gosh! That is a cool piece of furniture there! Holy cow! Rocked that one! And if you look over here, is this like maybe framed artwork? That's what I would think. And if it's framed artwork, maybe it's signed or maybe it's a uh, jersey. But let's take a look. Let's go through these real quick. We got baseball cards everywhere. There's another baseball card. And these are open. Looks like these are all open. And they, these are even sealed. Not a lot of value here. But there could be something in there still worth money. This is a racing stadium or something like that. Probably uh, the Brickyard. I mean, we are in Indianapolis. So probably a couple bucks there. What else we got? This looks like all like just man cave stuff. Check this out. Original Gangsters. All right, original gangsters, Al Capone, all that. This is a door off of something. I wonder if it's here somewhere. Maybe that. Look, that's got, yeah, I think this is. I think this is the door. Check that out. Check the pattern out on that. They go up to that. Oh, there's definitely going to be coins in that safe, guys. There's definitely going to be coins. Now, this is broke, but it is a cool, little cool uh, pull cue thing. So maybe there's a pool table in here. Maybe that's what the big empty space is. Baby basketball players. Okay, so far, none of this seems to be too awesome. In fact, the frames might be more valuable to us than anything else. Um, okay, don't do that one. That might be, these might be personals. Okay, they look quite personal. Yeah, those look very personal. Just gonna do those. Don't put those on camera. That is another brickyard piece. 392, and it is signed. That's a signed piece of artwork. Looks like maybe a watercolor. That could be some money. What we got here, we got, I don't think that's that signed. 1996, but uh, I'll have to look that up. Some of these little prints can be worth quite a bit of money. We got a uh, circus farm print, barn house, the same as uh, what that one was, 1997. Okay, there's some little certificates on the back, so that might be something. Board and that is a numbered that's a numbered print, so once again, that could be some dollars. It's a raccoon. I'm giving this to my sister, she had a pet raccoon, it was a pain in the butt. You guys think about getting a pet raccoon? Don't do it. There you go, James Dean. Everybody loves James Dean. All right, we got a Marilyn Monroe, and James Dean looks like playing poker. Painting the casino. Now, this is just a picture and it's kind of scratched up. I don't think that's going to be anything special. All right, here we go. Is it silver? 
silver plated, not silver, silver plated. Do we do it? Are you ready? Oh my God, this wool, that is full of food and it's moldy. No, that's a bad one. Give it a good open again. That's a bad one. You want to see? You guys want to see what we deal with sometimes? Now, see, you see this pretty furniture behind us. You're like, oh, it's so glamorous. Are you ready? Whoop, yep, that's garbage. <laughs> okay, table pads. Okay, that's not what I was thinking this would be. It says table pads. So, and that's what it is, like for a big dining room table. So, actually, those are worth some money. About, probably about 100 bucks. Um, so what do we got here? Let's do this one. This feels like a mirror. Yeah, yes, that is a mirror. I'm trying to see the very, it's not super fancy, just kind of a little bit of decoration to it, but not much. Just a mirror. All right, let's get this over here. We're trying to work. All right, let's see, let's see. come on, come on. Let's see. Neon pictures. Ooh. All right, let's see what we got in the uh, world of neon pictures. Oh, not even necessary, Mr. Knight. Maybe a little. Ooh, these are all that stuff nice too. Yeah, we're definitely going to be having to make another trip. Not getting that security deposit back today. Because there is a lot bigger stuff in here than it looked online. That is for sure. But hey, while we're, while we're just sitting waiting for this, so we got a nice chair. Nice little chair. But check this out, guys. What is this? Comment below if you know. I think it's like, an, like one of the sink, like little wash basins. Looks like you would hang towels on maybe these little guys. I don't know. Trash cans, maybe? That little guy, not part of the mirror, top to the mirror, looks like. But uh, yeah, see, I was thinking like bathroom or something like that, but now I'm second guessing myself on that one. I don't know. Here we go. Is this, is this silver? Look for some markings. It doesn't feel quite like silver. Let's see. Sometimes you can smell it. Yeah, it's got kind of a sweet. It's definitely silver plated. Real silver and silver plated has totally different smells. All right, where were we at? Okay, let's go. Okay, oh, it's broken though. See the neon tube hanging in there? This is one of those, uh, you see these a lot. It's like a bar scene or a uh, diner. It's the same thing that is. It's just a yeah. <laughs> No, not quite. They're sitting uh, at a bar in this one. James Dean Diner, but the tube is broke. So, wah, wah, wah. There's number two broken. Let's check number two, what's number two? Now number two is basically the same. Well, not completely. These tubes seem to be intact, so you know, I'll have to be careful with that one. Don't let me around it too long. Those are so light. Really stepping into the desert. And this one, this is definitely either a picture or a mirror. It's got a very fancy frame. I can feel it in there. What do we got? What do we got? Good. Now this is a paint. Oh, this is an original painting, for sure. I'm trying to get down to what it is. Looks like some boats. Oh shoot! Turn up here. But that is definitely an original painting. I'm not seeing. Yeah, there, it is named. Okay. You guys see that? Can you read that? I don't know. We'll see. That is uh, almost unlegible. So hopefully there's a name on the back. So we got something to go by because that's not going to tell us nothing. So I'm going to move this out of the way and not hit that, uh, that knee on there. All right, here we go. We got another mini fridge. Oh, did they do it twice? Look at the maggots. Ew, at least it's been here long enough. The, look, the bottom's clean. Why? Yep, it's going to be a bit before this gets any attention because that's going to have to be pressure washed. All right, here we go. We got this little table here that is missing something. Yep, something's missing on the bottom of that one. Okay. This is really a heavy piece of furniture. This is the cabinet that goes to that door that we found earlier. And look at that. It's got lion's paw feet. Oh, and so you see the split in the back. There's that piece of wood. So it's all here. So that's good. That's really good. All right, and then, so that goes with this. You want me to scoot this out a little bit, hun? We got the lovely Ashley helping me today. Everybody say hi to Ashley. Moment of truth. 
Is there anything in the dresser? Nothing, nothing. I was really hoping for something. I was really hoping for jewelry. Looks like nothing all the way down. Oh, we got a little something down here. I don't see nothing. Let's catch it on. All right, we have got more spray, an adapter, a holy Bible. See if it's personalized. If it's personalized, we'll probably leave it behind. Rock solid Bible. Doesn't look like it's. No, nope. it's not personalized. Okay, so we'll get that in somebody's hands that wants it. We got another tiny little Bible, celebrating recovery Bible. This looks like a stack of DVDs. I see eight mile on the top. Is that eight mile? No, eight balls in a mile. Okay, so it's not eight mile. It's something that I don't know what it is. Let's see. We've got Drake, El Cole, Eminem. Not eight miles still yet though. Okay, so all uh, rappers and stuff like that. Okay. And what is this? Normally this is drug paraphernalia. Let's check this locker though. Nope, it's some brackets. Yep, nothing, nothing to write home about. Okay, now something that is nice is this right here. Check this out. This is a really awesome air conditioner. That's one of those really nice LG, like you hook it right here. There's a hose somewhere. I've seen the hose in here somewhere. Goes right, right here. Goes right out your window. Exhaust out. This is a big one too. This will cool a heck of a room. Heck of a room, I say. All right, let's see what we got here. We got some. Don't keep all here. We got some glasses. A little mug. Precious moments. Another little decanter. Or what are they? Steins. Stein. Ooh. Did I break that? What is that? Oh, yours coins. It's coins. Guys, you know that safe is gonna be. Oh, ho, ho, ho. thumbs up, guys. Thumbs up. Oh, what do we got here? We got these are all like old. I think this is all silver stuff. Those are all nickels, but they're all like 1946, 1936, 1939. These are all wheat pennies. All wheat pennies. Let's see what we got here. Let's see. 2001 S proof. Okay, so these are just proof dimes. Not a lot of money there. Just proof dimes, proof quarters. That's the Colorado proof. There's more. Uh, if we got steel pennies in there, maybe we'll find that uh, that 19. What was it 44 copper that everybody's always looking for? But guys, with these being sitting up here, now I know there's nothing special here, but there's a little bit of money in this. But uh, all you've got to find is one right coin. And you're in the money. But with this sitting on top, you know there's something in that safe. There is something in that safe. You know, up here. We're sitting up there saying, hello, look at us. Now, right here, look, we got a penny roll, and that's just a regular penny. This is a, probably a singer. No, you know what? Don't say singer on the bottom. Let's see which way does it go. There's the hinges. Comes from this side. Dun, dun, dun. What was that? Gold Star. Never heard of that one. We'll have to look it up. Look how nice that comes up, though. That's pretty cool. That's an old dude right there. That might be... This could be $100. This could be $1,000. We will find out. We've got another penny. That one's locked. Okay. It doesn't come all the way out. So we're going to see down in there. Let's see if there's anything in there. Nothing in there. But it is locked. We'll have to keep our eyes open for the key. Okay, go this side. Nothing there. Mm, nothing in there. Okay. Still a super nice piece. Back behind. Back behind here, we have an old desk. These normally open, but this one just is down here, and there is nothing in the desk. Just an old antique desk. That's probably 30 bucks. Those aren't very, very uh, desirable. But hey, guys, that is it. And this unit is not done by any means. We have to go home. We have to break into this. Now, I've never broke into this one, this kind of safe here. So, uh, any suggestions? I don't know. We're going to have to uh, 
probably look it up, see where the pins are at, and then try to pry it from there. But that, other than that, uh, if we find anything in the bottom of this box of Spider-Man stuff, which I doubt we will, I'll let you know. It looks like all webs. Till we get back to the house, right here, right now, is a wrap. See you real soon.